it's not breaking news, but it's something we do have to talk about. Nikola Jokic winning the MVP for the third time in his career, 30 times in four years, and arguably he should have won it four years in a row. But it is what it is, and he has to be happy, and his fans have to be happy with this award. Another great year for Jokic, and it's not over. We all know that he's currently in a bit of a fight with Denver Nuggets against the Minnesota Timberwolves, against that great team that includes Anthony Edwards, Carl Anthony Towns, and Rudy Gobert. But we'll see what happens. And first and foremost, as a Jokic fan, it's great to see him getting recognized once again as the greatest player in the world. The Belgrade Tower was lit up in celebration of Nikola Jokic's third NBA MVP award. And you can now call him MV3, the new nickname for Jokic. It's a great achievement for the Joker. (laughs) Jokic at this point is even bored of winning the MVP award. In a quote here talking about the 2024 MVP race, I'm kind of used to it, so I don't even pay attention to it. I'm not sure if this was taken or quoted during the season or just now, but I suppose it was during the race for the MVP. And here we go, Jokic when he was announced as MVP, no reaction. Very calm and collected, although he did show some emotion when his wife did a narration of Jokic's career to date. And at the end, there was a bit of a clip of his family and particularly his daughter, his baby daughter, saying along the line something of, I love you, dad. He did show some emotion. He's not a cyborg, but the real part I want to talk about and see what your guys' opinion is, is in regards to Shaquille O'Neal. First of all, these were his comments on Jokic winning the MVP. I was the number one pick. I have four championship rings, an MVP. I'm still the best big in NBA history. Fair enough, you can say that if he wants. He probably might not be, might be the most dominant. That's not the real controversial stuff. The real controversy, as somewhat reported in this tweet, is the way that Shaq reacted to Jokic winning the MVP. He said, well done, you're the best player in the league, the best big man in the league, but you didn't deserve the MVP. Shea Gildas Alexander did. And he said it right to his face. Jokic just sat there and took it and, and laughed, laughed it off. I think Jokic is quite intelligent and sees that Shaq is just a bit jealous. Nothing to be upset about. Just a man who is getting a bit old, isn't he? Not to be ageist, but you start to really lose touch with reality, don't you, as as the years go on. And that's the truth for Shaquille O'Neal. As Darren McKee says here, I'm stunned with how Shaq reacted to Jokic. Shocked, weirdly personal and jealous. Talk about spoiling the moment. I'm sorry Jokic had to sit there and hear it. And it was only Shaq. But... The real point is that Nikola Jokic is the 2023-2024 Kia NBA Most Valuable Player. And that's for a third time. So well done to Nikola. And we'll see what happens now with the Denver Nuggets in the NBA playoffs. Until next time.